Hi, first graders. So today we are going to be practicing writing an introduction, opinion, and reasons for writing. To do this, we're going to look at a picture and come up with a, an opinion about it. And then we're going to write our opinion piece below the picture. I'm going to show you how to do it with an example. So I have a picture of a kid in a hammock. Now I need to create an opinion about that first. So I see someone relaxing in a hammock and I think that a hammock would be a really nice place to nap. So my opinion is going to be hammocks are good for naps. I can put that down first so I don't forget it. Hammocks are good for naps. The next thing I need to think about is an introduction to put before my opinion. So if I'm thinking that hammocks are good for naps, I need to think about kind of a fact or something general that I can say either about hammocks or naps. So I'm going to pick naps and I'm going to say that you can take a nap in a lot of different places because that is a true fact. So most of the time in your introduction, you need to have a fact about your topic. So my introduction is going to be, you can take a nap in many different places. So already I have my introduction and I have my opinion. So the next step is to write a reason for why I think that hammocks are good for naps. So now I need to think. He looks like he's, I'm looking at the picture and he looks like he's relaxing. I know that most of the time you have a hammock outside and if you're sitting in it, it's sunny out, it's nice. So my reason, you know, you can have many reasons. That was just a couple. So I think for my reason for why hammocks are good for naps, is that it's outdoors and the sun is relaxing. So I'm gonna say hammocks are good for naps. And then this is because, remember we can use that special word because it is outside and the sun is relaxing. Now it's kind of two reasons, but that's okay. Cause the more reasons, sometimes the better. So right now, this is my whole opinion piece. I have my introduction. You can take a nap in many different places. That's a fact. And then I have my opinion. Hammocks are good for naps. And then my reason. This is because it is outside and the sun is relaxing. So the next step that we're going to do next week is to learn about how to write a conclusion to close our opinion and to let people know that our writing is done. That's going to be next week. So today I want you to keep practicing writing your introduction, opinion, and reasons by looking at pictures and coming up with an opinion about that picture.